Hey guys and welcome! It's not long anymore until the start of Season 3 in Battlefield 2042 and we already got quite a few hints to where the new map could be located and what the setting could be. And today I want to take a look at these hints and what they could mean, but since we have no official info about the new map yet and not even leaks for it, it's all speculation at the moment. So only me guessing and trying to put the pieces of the puzzle together. But as always I would love to speculate with you, so be sure to write your opinion or guess in the comments below as well. And the first hint we got was added with the last update already and is a new weapon charm that can be found in the collection. This one is called Norland and can be unlocked by finding mysterious radios on the four maps Stranded, Kaleidoscope, Renewal and Orbital. But before you stop the video now and try to look for these radios, let me tell you that nothing happens at the moment. No matter how many of them you find, the weapon charm will not be unlocked, so you can keep watching, you won't miss out on anything, at least not at the moment. But I will of course keep you updated on this and inform you once the easter egg was activated. For now, the only interesting thing is the name of the weapon charm and the name written on the radios. Cause the weapon charm is called Norland, like I already said, and the radios have Nordvik written on them. And both points towards Sweden. Norland is the most northern part of Sweden with a subarctic climate and Nordvik happens to be a small town in this exact part of Sweden, so this might be the first hint that the new map could be another winter or snow map located somewhere in the north. Maybe at an arctic research center as this would fit the lore with a fight for resources and intel. And then there might also be a hint towards a possible night setting for this map, cause with the latest update there were two new laser sights added to the game, the green MGL and the blue STNR laser, and according to the description of both of them, they are specifically made for darker environments. And except for Manifest, there are not so many dark environments in the game right now. Plus, a while ago the data miner Temporial found the working titles of four unreleased maps in the game files and these were Rich, which turned out as Exposure, then Drained, which is the map Stranded we got this season, and the third one, and this is the one that might be interesting for us now, was Lights Out. And that could point towards a night map for which these lasers could that come in handy. So my best guess right now is that we might see a snow map with season 3, probably something around an arctic research center, but as a night map. Maybe something like the night version of the Battlefield 5 map Narvik with the northern lights. Cause what would also fit this theory, even though it goes a lot into speculation right now, is the new cosmetic bundle we just got this week. It includes two specialist skins for Falk and McKay and these ones are called Aurora and Cryosphere. And Aurora is just another word for the northern lights, while Cryosphere is the name for the parts of the Earth's surface where water exists as ice, so the regions around the north and south poles. But like I said, this is pure speculation now. Maybe the boats that Temporial also found in the game files quite a while ago and that we thought would be added alongside Stranded will now finally come into use as well. Let's see. It's not long now until we will finally get the first official details and surely a few more leaks before already, but for now this is all we know and can speculate about. And like I said, I will keep you updated about the easter egg, but I think it will surely get activated at some point during the next week, so keep an eye on the channel. And if you haven't done yet, drop a like or a comment below if you enjoyed this video and subscribe to stay tuned for more content like this. Until then, thanks for watching. I'm the Catwoman and you are awesome.